Somebody in this damn room has got to make a play. Hell, if I got to... If I gotta throw a set of pads on and do it myself, then I will. I ain't here to yell at you, okay? I ain't here to yell at you. I ain't here to bitch and moan at you. But holy hell, holy hell, that was bad. Listen, I'll be honest with y'all. We got a damn playoff game in the snow. And I know it's home field, they say home field advantage. Listen, there ain't no damn advantage to playing out there in the snow. The ball's gonna be hard as a rock. Okay, that ball is going to be hard as a rock when you kick that thing. It's going to be heavy. Be ready for it. Okay, receivers. It's going to be like you're catching damn boulders out there. All right, well, here's the worst part. They're like wet boulders in the snow. Because not only is it cold as hell, they're wet as shit, too. That dadgum thing's going to be dripping like a, like a dadgum Hanukkah candle. Okay, so it's about the fundamentals. It's about the fundamentals today. Facing the Rams, they have a very... Very good defense. We need to play ball control because they're going to take advantage of the weather. Now we can do the same, okay? But we can't be making no dumb mistakes. So we got to go out there, play play the football that we've been coached to play the whole damn season, and we got to come out of this thing with a victory, and we're going to the Super Bowl. The stakes are high. This is not going to be an easy game. Fields, break them out. Let's get the hell out of here. Coach, Question, this questions? instead of ice cream, can we get some hot cocoa? Oh, my Lord, you're talking about damn ice cream. Break them out. Let's get the hell out of here. Hey, fan, what's your favorite movie? Mine is Mind Goblin. Mind Goblin? What is Mind Goblin? Dude, they have a white uniform. It's like stealth, dude. They're freaking stealth football team. This is so bad, man. Mind Goblin, my nuts. Okay, really? Okay, here we go. This is going to be a, this is going to be a very rough game, dude. Okay, good. Good. Good stop. Play action. First play of the game. They're going to think we're going to run the ball. Okay, we just got work. Dude, I can barely see their defense, dude. It's, it's, they're, they're like actually stealth. Big power right here. Pre-snap motion and freaking blast them, dude. He fell again! You had nobody there, dude! Bruised ribs? Get your ass in the game. We are in the freaking conference championship. Wait, what? Was that Mario Edwards again? Wait, what's wrong? What's the injury? Broken ribs! Dude, really? You told me, doctor told me they were bruised. I hope this is, I hope this doesn't come back to bite me. I hope this doesn't come back to bite me. But how about this, a fake? And this is incomplete. You can do just about anything you want, but on the defensive side. Nice sack. Nice. Dude, that knocked him out of field goal range, dude. That was huge. Actually massive. Okay, really? On the one? Nice. Oh, oh. Nice. And out of bounds. Nice, Taysom Hill, nice catch, dude. But I have a really important question. I would ask this question at halftime, but all of the other Frick. players would make fun of me, hurt my feelers. Why dude, the I, flag I'm thing telling you, they are stealth. I didn't even see that guy, dude. <gasps> He's in field goal. Okay, he's got a field goal for sure. Here we go. Are you kidding me? Dude, they missed. Hey, hey. Eyes up here. Eyes up here. Dog shit. That's how I would rate this damn game so far. I told you this game was going to be hard. I told you this game was going to be hard. But that don't mean you can play like that. They ain't beating us. The weather ain't even beating us. We're beating us. That's what's happening. We're beating us. 
Zero to six, no points. I'll be honest, defense, you ain't done a bad job. You ain't let up a damn touchdown yet. But, hey coach, can I sit this next half out? This dick strain is really getting me. You've been sitting out the first half, as far as I'm concerned. When they miss a damn field goal at the end of the game, and you gotta go rough the damn kicker, and they get a second shot at three points right before the end of the half to score skip, skip, six points, as if it's a touchdown. That's ridiculous. We got the ball. Coach, our water boy came in my socks again. I can't play like that. I keep sliding, and it's not because of snow. It is snow. It's not not snow. Somebody has got to make a play. Somebody in this damn room has got to make a play. Hell, if I got to, if I got to throw a set of pads on and do it myself, then I will. To the reports, Hill went to Olive Garden and only ate two breadsticks. Get the His hell table out of my damn get an extra order of the free breadsticks to take Why home. are you in here? If someone is this wasteful on his own, how can they continue to produce on the this field? This is a damn team meeting. Get the hell out. I'm gonna take care. I'm gonna beat this guy's ass. Okay, let's see what we can do, dude. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. Thank you. They'll look to throw now on first down. Escaping the pressure right. Trying to get it to run. Dude, he overthrew him so hard. Now Stafford. Nice. Big sack. Big sack, dude. <gasps> oh! Oh! What? He batted it down into the other guy's hand. Dude, the alley oop! Look at this. User swat. Boom. I can't catch it. Boom. Swat it down right into this guy's hands. Dude, we're just we're just trying to pound the ball, dude. Three and a half yards of carry is what we're getting right now. Oh! The seam! Touchdown! They've got to figure something out, though, because you cannot let... No! Oh, my gosh. Oh, what a hit! Pop the football out, dude. What? My goodness. Oh, perfect timing! User pick, Dion Moldro, the rookie safety, dude. They get it? Nice! Hope we heal in the sky, you on dirt him. Nice. Dude, Justin Fields doesn't even have 100 yards yet. It's fourth down. Ready? Three. Oh, and now movement and a whistle, and they may have to rethink their plans on fourth down. Chat, sometimes you just have to trust your athletes, and that's why. We're going to give the ball to Robert Griffin. Here we go! He's going to keep it. He's going to try to run for it. No oh, frick! Come on, RG3! We're gonna go to safety. We're gonna go to safety here. We're gonna go up by Flugel right here. Ready? Three, two, one. I feel it. I feel it right here. No! 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 If we stop him here. <gasps> he did He didn't land in the end zone! That means with a touchdown we win. With a touchdown we win. Game on the line, season on the line. They're going for it here on fourth down. They'll look to throw. Block somebody! You had wide open. I couldn't get my feet set to throw it. Frick! Frick! I need you to unhitch the wagon. After the pick six, they go right back to the air. 
Dude, he's still running. Why is he? Is he running in the? Is he running in the locker room? Adjust to the football. Can we ask the Rams if we can have some of their ice cream? There's no ice cream ever. Take a damn seat. Quit packing your shit. That was damn near post-apocalyptic nuclear explosion, complete and total meltdown. Damn Mako Reactor Final Fantasy VII bullshit. Okay? Hey coach, I got the Delta variant and was spending the night at your mom's house last night. Just a heads up. <sighs> that was our game. To lose like that at home, Super Bowl favorites 14 and two. Coach, Allen Robinson here. I want to request a trade after you ran the ball four times in the last three minutes of the game. Listen, maybe if you would catch something for once in your life, we could throw it. And maybe if we had a quarterback who could get his damn feet set and put some damn power into his throws, wouldn't be throwing five interceptions in a game. Listen, I know it's snowing. I told you that. You knew that. You got to put a little bit more juice on it. I ain't, I ain't here to yell at you, okay? I ain't here to yell at you. I ain't here to bitch and moan at you. But holy hell! Holy hell, that was bad. That's the worst damn football I ever seen. Now listen, like I said, I ain't here to yell at you, and, and I, I don't want, I don't, I don't want this dead gum colossal monstrosity of a last quarter of a football game to <clears throat> take away. I'm sorry, coach. From the good. I let you down. I let my brothers down. You did. You did. But most of all, I let my Nana down. You did. You did, Doug. We. There's a lot of good that happened this season, but there's there's obviously some major issues. Obviously some major issues with this here football team. And uh, I'm proud of what y'all did in the regular season, but this is unacceptable. Coach. Coach. Stop, Doug. He is stuffing fields in a locker again. Can defense get ice cream because they scored more on defense than offense? Hey, no, nobody's getting ice cream. And two, Doug, get Fields out of the damn locker because he's got to pack his things because he probably ain't going to be here next year. I'm going to be honest with you. I got to face the damn media, okay? And put up with y'all's bullshit in front of them. So think about what you did and help Fields pack your things. I want to address a couple things right off the bat. Um, I do think as far as coaching decisions go, I think we had excellent play calling all game, offensively, defensively, special teams, uh, but we just did not execute. And, and that's just the reality of it. And if we don't Coach, execute... Do you teach your quarterbacks to throw footballs or throw games? I'm going to be honest with you. I, I, I'm about to teach that son of a bitch to throw laundry because he's going to be throwing all this shit in the damn equipment room before I fire his ass. Okay, that was the worst damn display of quarterbacksmanship that I've ever seen. We do feel like we have a lot of talent on this team. We feel like this is a Super Bowl caliber football team. Hey, coach. In the back. Stacy from. Um, um, Bears fan club. Uh huh. Um, can you like put a, um, dug in? Maybe you'd score more. The only thing we're going to score is the dadgum orchestra score. Because Doug is a damn good violinist, but he ain't, he, he just ain't there as a running back. You know, obviously we had some injuries down the stretch. We, you know, Mario Edwards broke his ribs early in the game. We heard it was, uh, you know, bruised ribs. He said he couldn't breathe good. He said he had a little bit of bruise. Doctor checked him out, said it was bruised. He said, okay, it's fine. Get your ass back out there, son. He goes back out there and ends up breaking his damn ribs. So uh, we think it was a hairline fracture that may have gotten worse. Uh, that doctor, is, he, he, he will not be with us. You know, and, and that's, that's a serious issue. I'm going to be honest with y'all. That's a serious issue, and, and, and we, don't, we, we don't need hey, any coach, of that. Our what was staff. the philosophy behind choosing not to chew the clock when your team was ahead in the fourth quarter? Listen, I don't chew no clock, okay? Trust me, I did, I did plenty of chewing on the damn sidelines because I was chewing ass up and down the damn, from, from 120 all the way to the damn other 20. 
Okay, I was chewing ass all night. I didn't have time to chew no damn clock. Hey, coach. Grant from the Chicago Tribune here. The play calling was absolutely atrocious. Oh, Lord. You went for it on a fourth and long in the first quarter. Do you think it's time to bring in a real offensive coordinator? Listen, listen, listen. I can call the plays and head coach the football team. That's fine. Okay, some folks want to make a, you know, bring in a play call specialist and this and that. It don't matter. Coach Rob here with Sports Drama. What are your thoughts of the rumors of you being possibly fired because of the poor performance in now, the game? there's no way in hell I can get fired. I'm the best damn coach this team has ever seen.